So let's go over how you're going to control your Fisher Technix interface setup. Um, you're going to connect the power and the USB cord and plug the controller on and you're going to open RoboPro on your computer. Um, once you do that, you want to come here and check and be sure that this says RoboTX. You always need to do that first before you start programming. Then go to COM USB. Be sure that you are connected. The interface says RoboTX. This says USB and click OK. Now we're going to say OK. And now just to be sure that everything's working correctly, we're going to click the test interface and look at it. You don't have anything plugged in, so you shouldn't see anything here or here, but you should have this green bar and it should be master that is selected.